while I sit here and mentally recover after a tough week, I'll tell you all a story about my coolest photo project ever. During my last year of university, I was in a five-person class where we could pursue any visual art project that we wanted. We would have the full art department and all the resources behind us. So pretty much anything was possible. Animation, sculptures, mural paintings, modern dance exhibitions, you name it. Surprisingly enough, I just decided to do something with rowing. I racked my brains for a while, couldn't come up with anything until I came across some cool light painting photos. So I decided to combine light painting and rowing. First step, learn how to properly take good long exposure photos. It's actually pretty easy as long as you have a tripod. You open the camera shutter, shine some light towards it, close the camera shutter. Pretty simple. These were just taken in my closet. Next step, going outside. I went to the gardens with Joy and we spent a few hours trying a lot of different things. Nailing the focus in the dark was pretty tough. And of course, this happened. Anyways, I got my hands on some battery powered LED strips, took them to a secluded spot on Duke's campus and started playing around. Eventually I figured out what settings I really needed to use, how to focus the camera, which is basically a lot of trial and error. After a few weeks with the help of a few friends, a warm fall night in my own boat, I was all set. After a few hours and a hundred photos later, I was left with these awesome photos. If you look closely, you can see where I square and feather. I figured out which direction to row that would come out best on the camera because of the rotation of the oars. After a while of just doing some normal rowing, I decided to row in circles and try a lot of different shapes in the water. And I think this was the coolest photo taken that night. As you can see here, this is kind of what my setup looked like. The LED strips were just along the oars. I had to figure out a way to get them around the oar locks, all that kind of fun stuff. And of course, while I was taking my boat out of the water and de-ricking, my friends took the oars and used them like lightsabers. So I considered that night a success. And as the night came to a close, that was pretty successful, I thought. The rest of the project just consisted of learning how to print the photos in very, very large format. At the end of the year, I ended up receiving an award for having an overall cohesive body of work during my years at Duke, which is pretty much all because all my projects focused on rowing. Anyways, that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed. I'll be back on the training horse tomorrow. Like, subscribe, all that fun stuff. I'll get back to daily soon. Don't worry. Peace.